After more than half a century in law enforcement, Wake County Sheriff Donnie Harrison is hanging up his badge. Tomorrow, the county's newly elected sheriff will be sworn in. CBS 17's Kelly Kennedy sat down with the veteran law enforcement officer as he reflects on his career. Growing up on a farm in Martin County, Donnie Harrison didn't have much. His parents worked as sharecroppers. I can remember when my shirts were made of hog feed sacks and flour sacks, and I can remember when we didn't even have a car. But even then, he knew he wanted to protect and serve. There were state troopers in the area, and as a little boy, I saw them, and I thought they walked on water. And I made my mind up at a very, very early age. No, that's what I'm going to do. If God's willing to let me do it, that's what I'm going to do. The now 72 year old is feeling sad on his last day as Wake County Sheriff. It won't hit me probably till tomorrow or the next day um, when I don't have the car. I don't have that walkie talkie in my hand everywhere I go. Um, uh, it's, it's not gonna, like I say, it's not going to be easy. Harrison has been a law enforcement officer for 51 years. At the age of 21, he became a state trooper in Wake County. He spent the past 16 years as Wake County Sheriff. Harrison lost his seat to Democrat and former Wake County Deputy Gerald Baker. I don't think anybody saw it coming. I think it was just a wave that came through. Uh, and, you know, the people spoke, and uh, that's what I abide by. I asked him what's next. Harrison says he's not sure, but he does plan on spending more time with family. My granddaughter and grandson, uh, they want to see Papa a little bit more. At the end of the day, he's just grateful. Sometimes I stop and just pinch myself uh, to come from, from my background to where I am today. And God has blessed me. I asked Harrison if he'd ever consider throwing his hat in the race for sheriff again. He tells me he'll never say never, so it is a possibility. Reporting in Wake County, I'm Kelly Kennedy for CBS 17 News. All right, thank you, Kelly. And as we mentioned, the man replacing Sheriff Harrison starts this week. Gerald Baker served in the sheriff's office for 28 years before retiring last year. He will officially be sworn in at midnight. His oath of office ceremony takes place tomorrow morning at 10.